Greetings and blessings. Today is October 15th. It's a root day and I'm out here planting my roughly 20 pounds of seed garlic that I've been saving for, this is my th third season saving this garlic now. I bought in a little bit of seed my second year, which was last year, and I bought in a little bit of seed um, this year. But uh, from here on out, I will not buy in any more varieties, and everything will be uh, locally adapted to my soils and harsh climate. By 2028, we'll be selling organic seed garlic uh, across all the 50 states of the United States and let's get into what's this is looking like this is an 80 foot row this was grass that I scythed down I left the grass to kind of like make a bed and then I put some compost that I've been making for the past two years on the first half and then the second half is just a rough layer of wood chips and I'm gonna put grass or hay or this you know dead biomass and green alive biomass on top down there so I'm gonna name all the varieties as I go through and this 20 pounds will turn to 80 pounds uh, next year so the first um, bed or section of the first bed is EA I'm not gonna give my uh, secret names away but then EA goes and it's planted uh, four rows across so we're gonna have a whole bunch of garlic scapes in the spring and then it goes one, two, three, four, four rows all the way down. So EA starts from right here and ends at this stick. And this is how I will remember uh, which variety is which from this video. Real high tech label. Um, so this stick ends it. Then it goes into M. F which and then another way is either it ends on a th um, an odd number either three or five going across or maybe six that's an even number but uh, that way I know also where the one variety stops and the next one begins so MF goes from this white piece of paper all the way down to this next marker and the third variety is MG that one goes from here to here and the fourth marker being um, GC going from here to here and the fourth marker being HM going from here to here, fifth or sixth marker, we're on R O R E. That s starts and ends here, goes to Italian red. From Italian red, it goes to here. This is Red Russian. Red Russian goes from here 
to here. And this is Shelton uh, CT Hardneck. And here's all the bulbs, or the cloves, I should say, in their little spot. And I'm just going to come through and go like that. It's been the process, and then I have to wheelbarrow it one wheelbarrow at a time. See, that's what the bed looked like underneath. That's the grass that I scythe down from here. And then there is some my mulch piles over there. And then I wheelbarrow it over to here, through here. And then the next variety will be Vietnamese. Working our way down, still got to separate the cloves. And then I still have both the varieties of soft neck that I'm working with. Uh, here's the one. This is a gift to me from one of the owners of this land. It's from England. Uh, soft neck variety. It's really old heirloom. And then this is my soft neck that I've been saving from Orlando, Florida. <clears throat> we got Spanish Roja, some more uh, EA, that's going to be the same one from the, that starts off the front, and I'm going to have this end off the row. This is what I brought in, this is some, just call this some 99 local, from a local folk, one love to him. Been growing it since the 90s. And then we got the Vermont Unknown number two. And the Vermont Unknown number one. So just to reiterate through that real quick, just for my own record keeping sake. So we got one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and that's going to be ten different varieties plus, and that'll make it eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 different varieties that I'm working with. It's a little difficult trying to keep them all separated, uh, not mixing them up. So I'll come back through here for one final uh, video, naming off each variety at the end. That way I don't get them mixed up. And this is what it looks like uh, going from small scale to larger scale production on garlic. So one love wholeness. Thank you for your support. Jay's Grassfoot Garden Expansion Project updates. We will see you on the next one.
Peace.